welcome back to another video you guys i'm super excited about today uh not my favorite thing to do but it makes kind of the most difference so we'll just get right started into it we're gonna be working on the bug today and we're actually gonna be restoring some of the old wheels that were on this car so obviously these are just some stock steelies you know you can pretty much come with any car but look at the size on these man like <laughs> these are so small I'm like 125s on there my current wheels they're cool I wanted these two as well like I, I liked all these kind of like old school styles so i wanted to get that too but let me tell you the size on these bro 195s <laughs> that's why does these boys get i think the rear is the same thing yeah 195 60 15s 15 inch rims probably gonna take the tires from these and mount them on the other one don't really want to get a new set of tires but i might just to be able to have both wheels or whatnot but uh, we're gonna bust down on these real quick they've been in the garage for a while so i'm probably just gonna hose them down real quick So I'm actually painting these because I want to have like the OEM style, you know, because these wheels are kind of cool. They're like normal steelies, but I'm not just going to throw the steelies on there. I might or might not get new caps for them. This is what the cap looks like, but I might or not get new ones or maybe just restore these. But these go, let me show you how these go on. These go like so, so then you're only going to see like the outside. And that's what I want. I want to have like that nice OEM Volkswagen look. But uh, some of them are more rusted on than others, so they might need, they might need some new ones. This is what I'm going to use to clean them up. You already know. I don't want to struggle because what you can do is with the quicks, knock these out. I started sanding and this is where we're at now. I have a table that's prepped. I have wheels right here. I washed them all, they're all clean. They're just drying right now, they're almost almost ready. They're just drying and I have paint over here. I got my primer, gray primer, white paint, clear coat. So I think it's gonna go down. Jeez. After putting in a few hours, I mean, they don't look that bad. Obviously, I put in a good amount of hours to get them to where they are right now. That, this one was probably the worst one, as you guys can tell from all of them. Gray, 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 and like brown. But um, this one's pretty, came out decent. It's nice and like, not smooth, but I have filler primer, so that shouldn't be an issue. I actually hit up some of my friends and asked them if I should paint them because some of them had really bad rust on them and have like the lips a little bent. And I didn't know if the paint that I wasted was going to be worth putting on these rims. But, I mean, we're already here and they're already prepped. And I did spend like the afternoon doing them, so I think we're just gonna have to uh, lay down the paint. Mass check, scan check, let's get it. I'm let them cook for a bit, let them cook. And then hopefully, once I get the clean ones over there, we'll slap them on and then mount them tomorrow, hopefully in the morning. That's the plan, cause she's. Welcome to the next morning. I got my wheels posted up right there. Let's take a look. I left them outside overnight and I left the lights on it for a while and I took them off already, but they look sauce. I think they look amazing. The white definitely changes the color on them. I need to paint the barrels. I don't want the bears to get rusted either, but I think it's cool. I think it came out pretty nice. Not gonna lie, they're pretty fire. They look pretty good. The homie got down too, as well, so can't complain. I actually left the caps 
in vinegar and ba baking soda overnight as you can see it has all the nasty stuff in it now can you see that Got all that nastiness so let's pull them out see what look like. they did even clean the back of them and i did not honestly not expect that let's just give them a good scrub and see where they're at they look a lot shinier now though a lot shinier They definitely do look a lot better. They're not in the best condition. I might just need to order a new one, but that's fine. But this will definitely work for now. Man, it's been a minute, bro. Like, when was the last time I picked up the camera for this video? It was like, like maybe a month ago, a month and a half ago, because we painted the wheels, and then we had to literally do disassembly, and then we literally had to paint everything, wait on parts, do the engine, you know, completely engine overhaul. If you guys haven't seen that video, go check it out, man stupid fire you won't let you guys down um but right now we're actually got my package ready already it's a nice surprise for you guys for the wheels got the wheels back here yeah they're a little bit dirty i'm gonna have to hose them down because they have been sitting for about like a month month and a half like i said but uh let's head on over to the shop slap these on man i can't wait to see this in i hope this is gonna tie the whole build in together let's go get it pull up to the spot my plug <laughs> the last day with these wheels nah I'm not gonna miss them yeah, yeah. you know I gotta give the helping hand you know gotta get the car ready got something very exciting in here for you guys oh can't show you yet can't show you yet she's gonna be the cherry on top literally these were honestly some of my dream wheels too I just like like the old school vibe on them but uh, I think it's time for something new, something that complements the car a lot better. Not that these don't, but the colorway just doesn't do it justice to what we got going on, you know? Oh yeah. Currently about to buzz down on the other side. Look at this, guys. That's how you know she hasn't been driven. I don't know if you guys can see it. There's like spider webs all up in here, man. This is from the heater court, and I can't figure out how to take it off, so it's just gonna... He's gonna have to dangle there, and uh, Axel is gonna, he's gonna have to eat it up or something because I can't figure out how to take that sucker off. Always top your wheels, kids. Can't be rocking no dirty wheels, you feel me? Yeah, these were big dirty, man. Here you go. I was excited about this, boy. No, it's gonna fit. So they accidentally sent me a new one. I'm not lying. Thank you, J-Bugs. I appreciate y'all. But look how wet this looks, bruh. Sheesh. Tell me that shit is not wet, man. Look at that. I, I can see myself. Shout out to my boy, John. Help me out. Plug me up. Look at this, bro. I can see my. I can see myself. God damn. Look at this, bro. This shit's wet. This shit is wet. With the chrome hardware too and the valve chrome valve stem jeez we pull out all the stops homies tell me this isn't wet look at how wet this is bro let me know what y'all think in the comments man someone blow it up man look how wet this is sheesh now all the thing it's missing it's this i hope you guys fuck with it man this shit looks hard man look at this bro this is gonna look so clean cruising you guys should already know this spot this spot be legendary brought it here to take some pics get it in this lighting man i love the rims honestly let me know what you guys think man i honestly think these go way harder than the other ones and i honestly think that going with the actual new hubcaps made it a lot better than the other rusted ones and it's all in the details man like chrome on chrome on chrome with the white sheesh and the white really look at the sun just coming out man loves the bug really complements the engine bay just exactly how i wanted to honestly 
uh, aside from one more thing, I'm kind of down with the car for looks. You know, like I'm gonna do a bunch of other stuff that I have planned big down down the road. But as far as like to get it as a daily, it's it's kind of there. You know, all it needs is that drop that I've been talking about forever. And honestly, that's kind of it, man. I honestly love these wheels so much. These are the wheels that came with the bug, but obviously they were never in this kind of condition, you know? And I love them, you know? Super happy with the results. I hope you guys are too. If you are, make sure to leave this video a that fat thumbs up. We're actually gonna cruise it home, and then we're gonna cruise it home, but I'm gonna end the video here, guys. I appreciate you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a fat thumbs up. I hope you guys are enjoying the bug content, man. I really enjoy this car. It makes me feel I'm a lot better that now the car is in a lot better shape and condition, you know, than it was when I originally got it. Body work done, engine overhaul, you know, wheels redone, interior redone. It, the interior is not done, but we got a bunch of stuff done in it. And there's a bunch of parts that we still have that we haven't put on. Like the headliner and carpet that you guys keep bugging me about, but I just haven't done it yet. Have other things that I want to get done before that. Um, other than that, hope you guys have an amazing blessed day. If you guys have anything, any recommendations you guys want to see, make sure to drop it down in the comments below. I want to make sure that you guys are enjoying the content. So let me know how I'm doing. All right. Hope you guys have an amazing, blessed day. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.